Okay, well I just thought I'd make this video because um, it's quite a quite a strange situation. What I'm trying to do here is uh, plug this diagnostic tool into our BMW. We have engine management lights on and we have an airbag light warning showing on the dashboard now. I plug the diagnostic machine in to in the hope to try and get the fault codes and find out what the problem is. Um, but as you can see, it is plugged into the diagnostic port, but we're not getting anything on the screen here. Um, and this is not the only diagnostic tool which I've tried. I've tried about two or three others. And at first I was sort of scratching my head thinking, you know, what the hell is going on here? Um, but in fact, something you might not even think about, what you might need to do is have a look at your fuse box on the BMW. I've already opened the fuse box on the E46 here. And I've already had a quick look and that there, as you can see, is a broken fuse. So once that fuse is fixed, or replaced should I say, in the appropriate place, then the diagnostic port will be active again and it will read codes using the diagnostic code readers. Um, obviously I'm, I'm explaining this using the BMW E46, however, um, I guess the same scenario applies to any other vehicle that you're in, uh, whether it's a Peugeot, Mercedes, Audi, Toyota, whatever you've got, um, you know, the same scenario could occur. So if you are having trouble connecting to your diagnostic port or you're not getting any power on your diagnostic machines once it is plugged into the port and the ignition is on, then that might be worth checking because that could well be what the problem is. Thanks for watching.